In this video, we're going to learn how to use the isPrintable string method in Python. So the isPrintable string method will check to see if a string contains only printable characters. So for example, if we have the string, string is equal to abc, abc, 1, 2, 3, space, and then maybe some symbol characters like dollar sign, at, and exclamation mark. We could output the string on the terminal with print string. We could save our program and try it out. And here we can see all the characters show up in the terminal. And each character takes up space in the terminal. Let's try to use the isPrintable method with this string here. We'll have here print and then string dot isPrintable to test out the method. We'll save our program and run this. And here we get true. And that makes sense because all these characters are printable. Letters, digits, the space character, punctuation marks, and symbols are all printable characters. There are other characters that are not printable characters. So for example, formatting characters such as newline and tab are not printable characters. So if we put the newline character into the string with backslash n and then save a program and try it out, then we'll get back false. There are other non-printable characters. So for example, the special character cancel is also not a printable character. We could use the special code backslash x and then 1.8 to insert the special character cancel into our string. Again, if we save our program and try it out, we'll get back false because the cancel character is not a printable character so the isPrintable method will return true if the string contains only printable characters. Otherwise, if the string contains even one non-printable character, the method will return false. So this is how we can use the isPrintable method in Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.